This video is brought to you by Pop Top Soda Pop and Candy Shop, located in Meridian, Idaho. This store has hundreds of soda selection, nostalgic candies, vintage tins, and novelty gifts. If you're traveling through the Meridian area, stop by Pop Top Soda Pop and Candy Shop. Hi everyone, I'm Tyler Bugarvi. I'm here with my brother Tim, and my brother Billy, and my friends Justin and Steven. And this is the three year anniversary. I can't believe I've been doing this for three years. I can't believe I've, I've been doing this for three years. Yeah. Nearly and I can't episode. believe it's not butter. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe you went there. <laughs> well, I've been doing this for three years. Last year I just reached 100 subscribers, and it's almost the end of this year, even though you'll be seeing this in January. I'm at 350 subscribers at the moment, and who knows what's at, at that time, so... I don't know if I needed that. Thank you. You did. you did. So I've grown a lot, and I thank all of you so much for watching, and I look forward to the future when we have more soda reviews, more documentaries, more video game stuff, just more anything. But I thought we would go back to where this all began with Mr. Cola and do a re-review. -re now, there's only me and Steven there, like, and Mina, but since she's not here, it's just me and Steven who have reviewed this. And oh, I think uh, these three should try it, because they're also really part of the big review team here. I've been looking forward to trying this soda again for a long time. I have not. Why? I don't like colas. Oh, good point. <laughs> okay, well. But this is one of my favorite sodas of all time, and this I did give this a 10 out of 10 in our soda documentary. Steven gave it an 8, and Mina gave it a 10 at the time. Oh, 10 would so yeah, and uh, this is my favorite cola of all time, so I am definitely excited to drink this again. So let's all give this thing a smell. It smells carbonated. It smells really <laughs> strongly of vanilla. It does. Yeah, it does. That too. It does smell like a, uh, uh, like a like Coke Are vanilla. Are you trying to make me drink carbonated vanilla? Yes. <laughs> it does smell like a Coke Cola vanilla in a sense. So I feel like I have just enough of a cold that this actually smells like a hospital room to me. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. I don't know why, but... Well, everyone, let's take a drink of Mr. Cola. Well, everyone, um, Mr. Cola, I gave it a 10 out of 10 when I first tried it, and... I still have that same love for it. I still, it's still my favorite cola of all time, and I'm glad that I can actually easily access it now due to Pop Tops uh, candy shop that's in um, in Idaho that I advertise sometimes. And really, it's just that soda, that cola that I love. That in reality, I found it just as a found it by surprise at a was it? Oh yeah, farmers market, and that's what made me start all this. And I still love it. So that's all I have to say. There's not much I can add to that. Except that it's a cola that tastes like a cola, and it has a hint of vanilla to it, which I think just makes it right. Having not tried this for a while, it's been kind of a interesting thing to see what I thought of it back then and what I think of it now. Um, it does definitely taste like cola. I think the vanilla is a really strong aspect to it. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but... Uh, it, it didn't feel that carbonated to me. No. No. It was, it was not super really carbonated. Yeah. No. Uh, and I might have appreciated that more, but that's not a huge factor. But uh, in terms of taste, it still pretty much got it where it counts. Mr. Cole, you got it going on. <laughs> uh, as I said before we drank, uh, I don't like colas. Uh, I The only cola I really drink is Cherry Pepsi, and that's it. Uh, and I mean, so don't take this the wrong way as in this is better than the colas I've had before. I don't feel like my teeth are dissolving like I do when I drink <laughs> Coca-Cola. Uh, but I still don't care for it uh, that much. Dick. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> See, I really enjoyed it comparing it to the other major colas, uh, Coke and Pepsi. 
Um, it isn't dissolving the insides of my body, and it's not too goddamn sweet. <laughs> so it was the nice, perfect blend, and I really enjoyed it. I definitely prefer this over either of those. And um, now you have ready access to it. Yeah. Yes. Excellent. <laughs> um, so I actually drink this soda probably on a, probably a monthly basis. Ever since it got available. So. Yeah, it's. Uh, I actually really enjoy the soda. I mean, I'm not going to give it um, a higher rating than Diet Pepsi, because Diet Pepsi for life. For me. <laughs> I hate all diet sodas. So Diet oh, Pepsi is the it's best. It's his final year. <laughs> <laughs> hey, boy, look, your contract's ending. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, it's it's a wonderful soda. I really like it. I enjoy the, I enjoy the vanilla. Um... And, yeah, it's, it's awesome. If they had a diet Mr. Cola, would you just, like... I would try it. I mean, i have to see if it tastes good for... Mr. Cola, my rating has not changed. I am a solid 10 out of 10. I love it. It's one of my favorite shows of all time. My rating, likewise, hasn't changed. I'm going to stick with 8 out of 10. You've still got it. I'm Keep it up. <laughs> I'm giving it a 4 out of 10. Boo! <laughs> yeah! Ooh. I wow. don't like colas. <laughs> Wish we had a mic so that way I could drop it. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. I really enjoy it. It's something I definitely drink more than the more than its main competitors. And you, you like Steven says, you got it going on, Mr. Cola. Uh, I'm going to give it a 9.8 out of 10. Well, everyone, uh, thank you guys all, you know, drinking sodas with me and reviewing it. And, you know, it's been three years, and I'm still buying sodas and drinking them for your pleasure or pain. So, I get <laughs> More so for our bread. <laughs> no, no, for our pain. <laughs> but we, we drink them so you don't have to. Yeah. So, everyone, thank you so much for watching. New slogan. <laughs> we drink so you don't have to. You don't have to. I like it. Everyone, thank you so much for watching. Click Steam to see his movie review channel. He does great work over there. And uh, click any of these guys for, you know, they're going to lead him to some other videos. You know, some of them will be Steven, some of them will be other people. Who knows? Again, everyone, thank you so much for watching. Five, <laughs> four, three, two, one. Everyone, I'm... Oh, I spread your Yeah. And, oh, Tyler, I didn't mention this before, but... When you do your introduction, you sound really, really fast. You're like, hey everyone, I'm Tyler from the Overview. Sorry. That I, sounds I, mumbly. Yeah, I don't sound mumbly. Not yeah, you fast. Do. Okay, I, I exaggerated. Hi everyone, that's... I'm Tyler of the Big Overview. These are my jerk brothers and my stupid friends. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's how I feel about it now. <laughs> Just like have an episode of your angry at us. He's my jerk brother. <laughs> Just maybe slow your pace just a tad in the nuts. Hi, everybody. I'm uh, Tyler. Uh, condescending uh, about it. Oh, here. this is Steven. <laughs> he owns the show, if you didn't know that. Um, he, he tells what? me... Missiles fucking <laughs> Well, technically, I own the camera, so... I can't brought my own camera. <laughs> well, welcome to the bunker reel. <laughs> Alright, let's do Hi, this. Hi, I'm Tyler of the Big R Review. This is Tim, the potential college dropout. Who's <laughs> Billy, the actual college dropout? <laughs> and here's Justin, the gay guy. <laughs> <laughs> um, <Suck. laughs> oh, Alright, are we ready for this, guys? Yeah. <laughs> I'm a successful college dropout. <laughs> okay. Oh, man. Alright, okay.